Oof. There we go. Hi everyone. I'm just waiting for uh I'm just waiting for Minecraft to load. See, I've got a bunch of mods on there. And those mods are Oh hi Maple, it's okay. You don't have to be sorry about being late. I haven't even start. I haven't even officially started yet. I started the streams so that people could show up. Oof. But yeah, I'm waiting for I'm waiting for Minecraft to load. I'm also trying. I'm also trying to remember all the places that I'm that I advertise. Like, hey, I'm streaming. Ooh wah wah, ooh wah wah wah, ooh wah 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 wah, ooh wah 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 wah, ooh wah 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 wah. Yes, I did actually. I figured out a second, a different way that I could make Minecraft work and stream it. Uh, okay, I think it's ready. Um. I might have to turn up, might have to turn up my desktop audio a little. Hmm. Yep. There's the mo there's the Minecraft music. Wahoo! Minecraft music. Everyone loves Minecraft music. Uh, I guess I should go live. Wahoo! Oh, wait. What in the heck? Hold on a minute. Some I have broken something. This is f capturing the wrong window. <laughs> For some reason, this wasn't set properly. It was capturing Minecraft twice. Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> okay. Last time when I was trying to start the game. Oh, hold on, let me. Hmm. There. That'll do. Last time when I was trying to start start this stream, I made the world, but then I was like, "Hey, wait a minute! It's not showing up. It's gonna it's gonna hang for a moment while it's um while it's loading." See. Wow, 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 wow. Load. Okay. Here we go. It might take a minute. Cuz Oh dear. Yeah. Oh boy. That frame rate is the stream's frame rate is garbage oh boy I wasn't anticipating this like last like when I tested it out I didn't go live so hmm Well, dang, I guess I, be I guess I guess I better try something else. Huh? <laughs> Let me see if I can modify this a little. No, not capture cursor. Bad 
better, but not ideal. I would prefer not to be getting single digits in terms of frames. Oh boy. Mm, this is it's bothering me. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to play something else. I might have to play something else. I'm gonna try and deal with it for a bit. But if any of you are like, hey, this sucks, just tell me. Ooh, gunshots. Yeah, so one of the mods I have installed is called Dynamic Trees, and that adds a bunch of trees that, like, actually are kind of, like, realistic looking. Okay, it seems to have mostly stabilized now. So, uh, that's good at least. So, let me beat this tree with this book. And we'll see. And, and you'll be able to see why it's a dynamic tree. It's beating trees with books is not a very fast way of cutting them down. Look, it, it falls over. Isn't that cool? Hmm. I'm gonna wander around a little bit. Ow. Woohoo, caves. I love exploring caves. Look at my blood on the ground because I fell five, uh, like one meter. It's it's not technically physics. It's um Well I, I guess yeah, it is physics, but it's not like whoa, realistic physics. Oh, it's hanging up again. That was my game getting me going like whoa. Look at this pig. He's got spots on him. Hello pig. I've also I've got um, biomes of plenty on, so it makes more biomes that you can uh, you can explore, and they got cool stuff in them. It's got compatibility with um, dynamic trees, so that the trees that are added in the new biomes are funky and cool. I saw something over here, so I'm gonna check it out. It looks kind of like a village. Like it might be. I mean, there's something over there, but I'll check that out later, because that seems a little... That might be something dangerous. Oh. Okay. As you see that, that's like a villager house frame, you know? There's books in there. There's a door on there. Hey, what do you know? Hi, doggy. Ooh, what's this? A new friend. I know who you are. I say ominously. An engineer. That dog, did that dog just teleport? This seems like a cool place, but if I stay here for very long, the, they're all going to get killed by zombies and other creatures. Hello, fairies. I know. I, I remember you. That's right. I, I have knowledge. This isn't one of this isn't I don't I think this isn't a vanilla style Whoa. That's a big hole. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's uh that, that's a falling hazard. There's dogs in the hole? Why are there dogs down there? Oh, it's one of the, this Hmm. Projectiles, steel, aluminum, an axe. I will borrow this axe and this pickaxe. So that's a good start. I don't really want the sword, though. And I don't need any of the minerals, because I can get those pretty easily. Thank you. I will be sure to repay your kindness. Anyways, there are dangerous creatures 
lots of dangerous creatures, so I should not be near them if I want to want them to survive. Like I could help I could like protect them and stuff, but at the same time, that would be a lot of work and I'm not sure that I could do that like effectively at this stage of my uh, Minecraft uh, development. I'm not going to go inside that thing yet, because I see spider webs, and that's probably a structure full of monsters. Let's see how fast this chops. Oh boy. This chops very, very, very good. Let's see, what have I got on here? I've got Thelmcraft, I've got Immersive Engineering, I've got um, Thermal Dynamics. I could go through the whole list, but honestly, that's not... Me reading me reading stuff is not going to be very um, interesting. Oh, come on. Stop hanging up on me. I don't like it when the game freezes up. Which is probably happening because I have so many mods. And I'm trying to stream it at the same time with a computer that's not necessarily the newest. Like, it's a well-made computer, but it's not a new computer. I will have to replace it eventually. So, when it comes to me playing Minecraft, I have a pattern that I tend to play in. I will spend the first day or two, day or two wandering around collecting basically whatever resources I see, and I'll be like, oh no, I don't have a house yet. And then I'll sort of flounder around not having a house, and then I'll go, I need a shack so I can be protected from monsters. And then I will be like, and then I will make a shack, and I'll hide in it for half the night, and then I'll start trying to dig underneath it. How much longer have I got? Not too long, so I sh I'm going to be smart this time and try and get going. Also, Maple, you spelled golem wrong. It's G-O-L-E-M. I had to think for a moment, because I couldn't remember how words work. <laughs> Wandering around and collecting resources is fun. That's what survival games are about. Trenches. There's a mountain over there. I should build on the mountain. The spiders have have appeared. Hi, my arachne and company. I am. They have arrived. This is a great day. Oh boy, spider webs. An apple. I'm just trying, I'm just think. I think too hard about, I always think too hard about where I should go and, um, about where I should make my house, and, because I always get really ambitious with it, and I'm like, yes, I should build a castle, and I go and I'm like, yes, I will find the most perfect place imaginable to build my castle. Actually, this area doesn't seem so bad. There's a few resources I can access easily, such as this coal, which I really do want to have on hand. Finding that village was pretty lucky. Not not necessarily the village itself, but that the fact that they had... Uh, they had an engineer, and I'm able to just steal things from them. But it's not stealing, because
because I'm going to pay back their kindness. Cute skin. Oh, right. Um, the skin I'm using is Fluttershy. I found a Fluttershy skin, and I was like, yes, this is the skin I like. Salt. Salt is good. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna tunnel into the side of this mountain really quick. put that. I'm gonna do a little craft, cr crafty, crafty. Excuse me, sir. My house is not ready yet. You are not allowed inside. Hold on, let me, uh, thank you for the leather at the very least. I'm going to All right, bye, I guess. <laughs> um, crafting bench. Door. Put the door like so. <coughs> okay. Let me think. Gonna make a chest because I should put have something to put things in. Oh, I already had I I already had a chest. Okay. Take stock. Raw salmon. Bit of bread. I'll eat the bread. Should eat. I can eat the persimmon. The apple is probably better used as an ingredient. I have Pam's Harvest Craft on as well, if anyone's uh, curious about what where all this food came from. Apple Snow. Never heard of that before. It's probably some sort of dessert, considering it's meringue and butter. Yogurt. Oops. Okay. and mess. I've never heard of that before. Oh. Whoops. I guess this mountain is not as wide as I thought it was. Okay. Here we are. Start carving out a few rooms for myself. This is just a basic setup, so I'm not I'm not concerned about it being very pretty. Though I should work on it being f functional and pretty. Something that's functional and pretty is something that I appreciate a lot. Moth. I am a moth. Look at me. I bounce around on everything. Moth hole? I I'm not i I'm not gonna think about that. No, don't encourage don't encourage them. Oh whoops. There's more to dig out. There are no there are no clothes. Where did they go? I eat it.
Let me give me some torches. So I can light up my like so I can light up my world. I would love to light up your world too, and if 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 it's any consolation. I th I think having light, you know, so you can see in the dark is a good thing. Ignore the stereotype of moths being attracted to light. It is not because I'm a moth that I like light. I just like being I just like it being bright and cozy. I like a good fire, good fireplace. I like some nice hot chocolate, hot cocoa. Hot beverage like that is tasty. Ooh, amber. I'm not making these rooms for any particular reason. I'm just wanting to um, expand a little before I start going down. There's a fella outside. He's he's in the he's standing in the corner. Oh, he sees me. He knows I'm here. Anyways. I just need to make sure I have sufficient space before I start tunneling downwards. Should I? Maybe, maybe digging downwards from here would be a better idea. No, I can hear a lot of fellas outside. I don't want to... Hello? There's a, there's a sparkly fellow out there. Those guys are very dangerous. Um, let me think. Uh, I mean, I can just renovate later, so... Downwards I go. <gasps> Dirt! Dirt is nice. Fun to play with. Not to eat. Eating dirt is probably is not ideal. You sh if you're eating dirt, I would recommend that you don't eat dirt. Because there's other things that are tastier you can eat. Like potatoes, which grow in the dirt. I like potatoes. Um, this is entirely random trivia. Oh boy. Oh boy. There's fellas over here. It may not be wise to go down there until I make until I have a weapon I can use. I have an axe. It's still Excuse me, why are all, why, why are you, why are you booing me? Oh. Oh dear. Don't explode. Ew. There's a lot of them in here. Where are you coming from? Anyone else? Oh. Oh, I see. They have a way to come inside from outside. And it's daytime now. Oh dear. There's more fellas! Stop running at me! I don't like those guys. Ok. 
Okay, so I'm going to be wise about this. I'm going to light up as much as I can reach. Oh, no, I don't like these guys either. Yay! I'm dead. <laughs> now I have to find my way back. Oh. Uh, knowledge of death. Um. Hold on, I gotta sneeze. Um. Am I gonna sneeze? Hold on. Let me. Oh, fuck, it's stuck in my nose. <laughs> Okay, so knowledge of death uh, is something that was added by um, one of these mods called Corail's Tomb Corail Tombstone, and essentially uh, the main function that it adds is a gravestone, so that when you die, all of your stuff is conveniently placed inside a tombstone, and when you take your key and go back to your tombstone you can unlock the tombstone and get all your stuff back free of charge. See, I should have been a bit more careful. Is that a fella down there? No, it's not. I had to physically lean closer. To... Hmm. I have to be real careful here. I am currently invisible. I'm ghostly, which means that they can't see me. Okay, so I'm going to get back my stuff. Oh, boy. You see that name tag? That's because the thing that killed me... Um, oh, boy, that guy's a... The thing that killed me um, is now pretending to be me. Oh boy. I'm just gonna slowly beat it to death from afar. And then it explodes, of course. Perish! Die. I don't like those guys. Anyway, here's my tombstone. I got a present. But what was in there? Okay, so there are several mods that are interacting here, and I haven't explained all of them. Uh, some of them, the, the ones that have added those critters, those creatures that are like, right, that run at me, um, that mod is called Parasites Escape and Run. Well, Escape and Run Parasites. I think that's either the. God damn it. Okay, hold on. I'm going to be more careful with this one. Got him. The glowing rocks? No. You use them for magic, and I don't actually know how to use them for anything. Because I haven't gotten into that part of the mod. Oh boy, more fellas. Why am I eating rotten flesh? Man, that mod is not good at telling what is actual food and what is not. But yeah, the Parasites mod adds a type of monster that um that can assimilate other creatures. One of them is uh so is so it can assimilate human-like creatures. It can assimilate um. Oh boy. I 
need my doors. It can assimilate most vanilla mobs, including villagers, which is why I'm not, I decided not to stay around them. Um, and there's a few other things it can do. I'll put a door here for extra security. Uh, that little guy that like jumped at me and took control of my corpse, that is part of the parasite's uh, more advanced life cycle. Basically what happens is they can evolve and as they are able to last longer, they become more dangerous. Oh, I can hear them from in here. Ugh. I hate phlegm. Ugh. Oh, that's right. I also have a. Uh, this this skill book here. Every five level, splunker or miner. I'll just go with miner. Every five levels, I can put one level into this, and I can use that level to buy a perk. Oof! Excuse me. I'm gonna I'm gonna save up for toughness because that's right now uh, basically at full once you research all of it once you get all the perks you will be more powerful than vanilla but as a consequence um, you start out weaker than in vanilla more copper it also adds a few alternate ways to get experience uh, Oxide is good. I need to get my hands on some iron first, though. And hopefully I can find a dungeon. One of the modded dungeons, because that'll have some good loot in it. Some good stuff that, that I can use to make things. Because some of the mods require you to go to the nether to collect materials there. But one of the mods makes the nether significantly more dangerous. <laughs> so, um, I'd rather not go to the nether if I can, go to the nether if I can avoid it. Edible rocks? Um, I mean, salt is edible. I can cook things with salt. Uh, question for everyone. How is the audio balance? Sync. No, not all rocks are edible. You shouldn't eat rocks. It's not good for your teeth. Oh my god. Okay. Light up there. Search exploring. Oh, hello, my hello, my friend. Ooh. Oh boy. What did you drop? Oh. I don't want. I don't want your things. But I got a firework from that, so that was interesting. Be on the lookout for more, more critters, more salt. I have like three different mods that add salt, all found in slightly different 
unsettling. Yeah, you, uh, you and me too, buddy. I'm. I wouldn't. I don't want to go out there, and you probably shouldn't go out there. So, I'll let you stay in this cave with me if you'd like. You know what? I'm gonna do this. Little squiggler, gotta get you. The, those are the littlest form of the uh, parasites. If you leave them alone for too long, they reproduce and then they become the big guys, and that's no fun to deal with. Iron! This is what I was looking for! Thank you! Now I can begin technology. Okie dokie. String? I don't have string yet. Oh. I need to get, get string. Okay. I should... Oh, boy. Yeah, hearing those screams outside is not very relaxing. So I'm going to have to find a way to deal with them. Preferably from afar. Okay. More aluminum. I can leave that for later. I need to preserve my pickaxe. I decided not to add Tinker's Construct because that is complicated as heck. And having those fellas outside... You know how dangerous these guys are? Oh. Yeah, I'm not going out there. I do have guns. I do have a mod that adds guns. Stop screaming. Jeez. I know you're excited to see me, but that's a little excessive. Fill this in since I'm not going to tunnel over that way. Stop screaming! Jeez! Get some copper going. I should have grabbed some wool while I was out while I was out there last. Either way, shield proficiency, iron skin. Should also build up my sprint speed. My sprint speed. You fuckers. this away. Sort it. Let me think about my options. I don't need this wooden pickaxe. I'm going to have to kill it because it's dangerous and I don't like it. Okay, shears. Bucket. And I'm gonna go with a hoe. Because I need to get I need to start working on my food supply. Oh my god. 
Még. Can I shut up? Egg? Can I eat egg? Yeah, I can eat egg. For some reason, the Tombstone mod added make a release an update on Easter that added Easter eggs that just appear all over the place, and it's like, God, I hate the. I don't want Easter eggs. It's not Easter anymore. Easter was several days ago. Listening to them scream is going to drive me insane. I'm sorry, that's the way it is. I'm going down. I'm going down. Well, that's not what I want. <laughs> what I need is tin. Oh, fuck. I should I should have used my iron for something else. Too late now, though. Really am. I can turn down mob volume, but also I don't really want to deal with that. I would much rather find an organic solution. And by organic solution, I have to kill them. More aluminum. Good, but that's not what I need. Copper, not also not what I need. So I found some tin and I found some more iron. I would be a very happy lady. A very happy moth. No need for salt at the moment. Eventually, I'll find something. Mm -hmm. It's water. Close. Question is if I'm this way. Ha. Ah, this is what I heard. Are there any enemies nearby? I hear something skittering. <gasps> oh, oh gosh. What is this? There's a chest over there. Oh boy. This is something exciting. And there's some iron. That's what I was looking for. And I do think there's some tin nearby. Perish. Okay, I shouldn't go further that way. I'm out of torches for the moment. And it's wiser to cut my to to get what I came for and leave. More iron? No, no more iron. Iron this way. Coal and stick. Makes a torch. Wow, there is not a lot of iron around here. Oh, hello, friend. Goodbye, friend. Where did you come from? What spawned you? OK. 
Okay. Ooh. Spy something. Oh my. It's a large creature. I don't think I can handle that right now. Oh, there's more iron there. I should smelt this. Because now I have tin. Silverfish, get out of here! Oh, there's a bunch of them. Oh, he left. Goodbye. Because... Is that it for tin? More tin? Tin. Let's see. Okay, so I've got tin. I've got my copper. Now, you... Any of you out there who are particularly knowledgeable about metallurgy or have played any sort of Minecraft tech mod ever, uh, you will know that bronze is, is something that I can make. Bop. Iron skin, there we go. Now I am a little more durable. I guess I can subsist off the Easter eggs at least. Like, it's not that bad. It's daytime. Mm -hmm. You, you are a knowledgeable individual. Or in this case, collection of individuals. Um, I need ingredients. Not much else matters. Oh, this must be connected to that other thing. There must be a critter down there. Okay. Harvest some gardens. Make sure that I don't fill up my inventory too quickly. Hmm. I don't need the rotten flesh. Is that a cherry tree? Oh gosh. I better go check that out later. I love I love things that are pink. Now I go back this way. I'm gonna reopen this. Make it taller. So I can actually go through it easy more easily. And Ooh, ah, wah, wah. Oh, they're screaming again. Thankfully, I will soon have a solution. Get some flax? No, I did not get some flax. Did you get some amaranth? That's a good start. Okay. To begin, I iron. Because I, I still need string. That's right. Should I risk it? I'm going. Come on, buddy. Perish. Oh, he exploded. Don't do that. It's unsanitary. Oh, I should clean up the bits. Chili pepper, elderberry. Onions are good. I saw a different garden over here, so I'm gonna... Oh, 
I thought I did. Groot the Miserable. Soggy Garden, yes. Variety. Seaweed, okra, flower. Big trees over there. Most important part is I get string. I need string, otherwise I will not. I'm also realizing that I need to get hemp. And some vanilla seeds too, while I'm at it. There's my first piece of hemp. Another garden. Oh boy. Not a lot of seeds. Come on. Stop hanging up on me. <laughs> that was, that's flax. I, that's what I needed. Got a bucket, so I better pick up some water. Oh, and there's sheep around. I can use my shears. Uh, yes, most of the time the freezing is because my. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Most of the time. Oh! Fuck. That startled me. I think that's enough. Oh, bits. Get out of here. I gotta get back inside. It's dangerous out here. But yeah, some of the freezing is because it's loading new chunks, and the mods are like, whoa, what's going on? It's, you know, it's not, it's, it's not, it's not nothing special, but not, not, not what am I talking about? It's, it's it's not something that I can very easily deal with right now. It's an issue with Minecraft It's being modded. And me shoving 100 mods into it. Okay. Now, can I make this into string? No. But it does give me access to a bed. I got a bit of... I got a bit of... Because I'm almost dead, you can hear my heart pounding. Bit more dirt. Gotta find a water source somewhere. Water, water, water. That's not a source. Ow. The sodium sweet? I don't... I could do that later. I, I might have it installed, actually. I just don't know how that kind of thing works. I'd have to check. I don't pay attention to all the mods that I've installed. I just install them. Which is, admittedly, probably not the ideal um, way to, like, mod, like, you know, play a game. Okay. I need the flax for sure. I'd better not go outside for a little while. The berries I can eat. Cranberries. I can plant the cranberries. I'll plant a cranberry. Eat the other one. Lettuce. I have onion. I'll, pl I'll plant an onion. 
Can I plant blueberry? Yes, I can. Onion. Bit of corn. No, I don't like corn. Didn't pick up any tomatoes. Asparagus? Parsnips? Potatoes! Did you know that potatoes and tomatoes are related? Uh, they're both members of the nightshade family. Which uh, also includes peppers, and also includes the infamous deadly nightshade. Uh, thankfully, um... They are not actually poisonous. It's only the deadly night, the, the deadly variety that is um, poisonous. Peppers, tomatoes, and potatoes all came from South America. If you really wanted to, uh, carrot. Yes, I did have a. I do have carrot. Carrot is a year is from Europe, and it's related to the parsnip, which I will also plant. Pepper, mustard seed. I'm going to go with mustard seed because I need some spices. Water chestnut. That was a thing throughout most of Europe, actually. Um, so, the reason they thought that is because... The nightshade, the flowers of the nightshade plant and the flowers of the tomato plant are very similar, such that they're almost identical. And so, people who... Oh, there's more danger out there. I'm going to have to build an, in an enclosure. As soon as I have a reliable source of food. What other reason is it? I'm curious now. Raw salmon, can I cook this? I mean, I can cook it, obviously. Ah, I see. That's a very fun fact. I appreciate that fact. It's going to be a while till I can get this flex, so I'm just going to focus on... Eating and healing. Do I more torches? What do you mean the most neurotypical? There's no no such thing as that around here. Fun fact about potatoes: it, it you the um the human body can subsist on them. On just on a diet of just potatoes, if you absolutely wanted to, one of one of you people could be like, "Yay, I like potatoes," and eat no, eat nothing but potatoes, and be perfectly uh, fine. Maybe a little anemic, but if it worked for the Irish for Irish uh, farmers for a long time. So it'll work for you. Basically, uh, you have to eat like 20, 20 something pounds of it. Yeah, you gotta eat eat the whole potato. And you gotta eat a lot of them. Okay. Now I'll just build up a perimeter. Uh, fun fact about why it didn't work for the Irish. It's because um, they ended up having a... Mul uh, a um, not a... A monoculture. That's what it's called, a monoculture. And the issue with a monoculture... That's where it's all of the plants and such are from the same, like... What's it called? when they're all genetically identical or very similar, then they're all vulnerable to the same diseases and parasites.
um, the modernly, this is something that has happened with bananas, uh, which is why uh, the actually the the English um, did not uh, they did not like potatoes at all. They considered uh, potatoes to be a lazy man's crop because they grow in the ground. But, uh, yeah, um, the real reason that the Great Famine happened is because of the, of, because of the English. Because the English, uh, made the famine actively worse by increasing tariffs on the Irish farmers. And saying, okay, all more, you have to give us more of your crops because we want money. Because most of the Irish, uh, most of the Irish folk who uh, live, lived in Ireland, they lived on land that was legally owned by the English. Because the English uh, took it. At any time, the Irish were like, hey, we want our land back. The, Eng the English were like, uh, no. It's okay, Maple. You're not one of you're you're not part of the problem. String, string. Almost there. The 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 true enemy is the merchant class, because they wanted more profit. And when some when when someone wants more profit, they always cut people. They always decide that people aren't worth the money. That's all my cobblestone. Now all I have to do is wait for this flax. Because I need string. And that's a and flax will give me string. Can I craft this directly into string? Hmm. Enchanted fabric. Make a balloon. Fat make dyed things. Armor. Oops. I could sit here and wait. Because I don't want to use my iron until I have my hammer. Where's my iron? There it is. Because I need to make a hammer an engineer's hammer so i can smash these ores into 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 dust and then i can mix them to create bronze cuz minecraft is weird and the mods are, don't all come together in a way that makes sense I'm going to have to grab them. Um... Yeah, or dictionary is a good thing. I think I have it on here. I think it comes as part of Forge as by default. I'm just going to fill this in with wood. Yeah, I do remember that. That one, those times were not great. Come on. Grow. I need string. Hold on. Let me 
I can reinvest my points into green thumb, which make it so that there's a chance for crops to grow extra ticks. Come on. Come on. You can do it. I'm not sure my encouragement is working. One percent. Hmm. I could start smelting some of this other stuff. I don't really have much that's worth smelting right now. I guess I can just gather. I can gather some dirt so I can expand my farm. That seems like one of the only real ways to be productive at the moment. Because the more farm I have, the more resources I will have. Didn't break. Water, water. Ah, <sighs> oh, it's getting dark. A spice leaf. Asparagus, squash, bell pepper, lettuce. Can't make a lot out of peanuts. Snickers bar, fascinating. I can make, I can use it to make tofu if I have a lot of ingredients. What's this? Pemmican. That could be reliable. I need meat. Seeds, butter, pad thai. Oh, I would I would love to have some pad thai. Nut bread. Bell peppers. Make it I can always make it to veggie strips, stir fries. A western, a toasted western. Now I'm getting hungry. I should stop looking at this. Oh, I'm going to keep looking at it, but I shouldn't be like, mmm, mmm, delicious food. Supreme pizza. Pizza would be pretty good. Steak fajita. Last time I got a, I had a fajita, I got food, I got food poisoning. Really bad. I guess I'll grow some corn. Amaranths. Aspergus. Amaranth. Bell pepper. Squash. And lettuce. You're not growing, buddy. The cranberries are growing. Not the flax. Do you need more light? I can give you more light. I mean, it's not quite sunlight. Minecraft is weird. Is it now safe to be out here? Moderately. Maybe things just haven't started just haven't started spawning. Oh, why see that little guy? What can I do with this? Recycle it in the arc furnace, but I don't want to do that. I don't have an arc furnace. 
to recycle it with. The potatoes are finished. Cooper, what do you mean? <laughs> Cooper, why are you calling me gay? How dare you? Spider. It's not as safe to be out here as I thought it would be. What? What the fuck? What's that? <laughs> oh, he, he's coming over my walls. I get him. He picked the you and you have entered the wrong domicile, my friend. But that means my my defense is, is not perfect yet. So I should be, I should work. Yeah, any of you growing? No. I'm going for the nuclear option. Bone. <gasps> Yay! And I can use. I need more flax. Yes. String. Now I can do the thing I was waiting for. My engineer's hammer. Now I can mash things up like a real professional. Yeah, that's it. Bronze. My savior. The reason I want bronze is because bronze is about the same strength as steel in these mods. Which means if I make my tools out of bronze, bronze is easier to access than steel. I can make things out of steel out of bronze and save the steel for more important applications. Sticks. Give me your sticks. Uh, stick. Here we go. Bronze pickaxe. Handle. Need a bit more bronze for my, my my new sword. Deposit my excess items. watch as I construct a weapon. A mighty weapon. A bronze greatsword. Come here, buddy. The great property about this, it has reach. Oh boy. I better tower up. All right, come here, buddy. It means I can hit them from much further away. Yep, come on in. Come on in. None of you can touch me. <laughs> uh, 
they're just pouring on in here. Anyone else? Um, I can reinvest here. Daylight approaches. here your death it is calling you give me your bits yeah uh you can't actually get you shouldn't actually give me like twitch bits right now i don't have a way to do anything with them so don't do that if you have any don't do that. Okie dokie. So, I have more bronze, which means I can make a one more tool that is very important hammer. This is a different kind of hammer than the other, than the hammer from the other mod. Ooh, a zombie bread. Bread from zombie. Hold on to this. Maybe a few bits of wood. Um, can I really make anything else right now? I have everything I could possibly need. So, I'll head back into the mines. The great thing about this hammer, it digs in a 3x3 three three square. This is efficiency at its peak. You see how quickly I dig? You see how much I dig in a single in, in a single strike? It's it's unreasonable. It's unfathomable. Even though it is both fathomable fathom fathom fath fathomable and reasonable because it's happening right now. Beryllium. I died of there is actually no reason for beryllium. Yes, diggy, diggy hole. I love digging holes. D digging holes is puppy is 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 gender affirmation for puppy girls. There's a fella out there. I can hear him. But now that I have this hammer, what I will do is dig up all these minerals that I've been waiting and ignoring. And yes, dwarfs also dig in holes. But I'm a puppy girl. And so puppy girls have to dig. Because digging holes is what puppies do. I'm very complicated because I'm a moth, but I'm also a puppy. But I'm also, also a doll. Consider that, liberals. <laughs> I 
I'm a strange beast. Bauxite. For those who aren't aware, bauxite is a mineral that is that contains aluminum. Or I suppose the depending on where you live, you may say it differently. You may say aluminium. Which technically is the more correct way to say it. But Americans have a way of ruining things. Historically, the Americans have not been great for the world. I love digging efficiently. It, make, it makes me happy. I, mean, I love I love having tasks. I love digging holes in the ground. I love wandering around inside the holes in the ground that I dig. Look at all this! Look at all this efficiency! Look at it! Oh, I better get the aluminum too. But yes, um, if you saying it as aluminium uh, actually is the more correct way to say it because it follows this, the, pa the, the pattern that all other elements do. Cadmium, beryllium, and uh, potassium. It all ends in um. If things are patterns are good. Patterns are good. Patterns are good. Okay, okay. More coal. Oh yeah, but that, the Latin names don't follow that pattern. But that's also because Latin uh, people who do science have like a weird uh, intro. They 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 like um, Latin too much. As in, they like um, Latin to a degree that is. Sometimes uncomfortable. They take stuff in Latin and Greek, and then they they they, they name things in Latin and Greek, and it's like, well, what's the point? Oops, that's that's not what I wanted to do. Oops. Tin? I did not dig up any tin yet. So I better go back to that spot where I was earlier and do more digging there. Somewhere here is tin. Actually, I feel like the like the reason that they use Latin, it's probably less because they just like Latin and more because they're like, yeah, the, the, the Romans and the Greeks were very good at science. And so, because we're good at science too, we're gonna say that we're gonna say things the same way they did. Does that make sense? Ooh. Yeah, I killed him. I love murder. Ooh, more iron. 
Danger. Ten. I hear screaming. That's not ten. 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 Here's some ten. Yeah, was, yeah. The real reason is probably just because they they use those names because it's it sounds not, it's smarter. It's not like if you say something in English, it's like yeah, this is a horse. But also, Arachne brings up a good point in that part. Of, one of the other reasons that they, that they do that they use Latin is because Latin is a language that is not going to change anytime soon. It is not a language that is spoken by living people. Which means it's a language that is stable and they can name they can say things in Latin and it will stay meaning that thing for a long time. I'm also making all the stuff up without actually having that much knowledge on the subject. So don't treat me as a, as like a, a reliable source. Oh, there's more more tin here. Oh, gunshots. Hmm. <laughs> What do you mean, nuh -uh? You should not quote me on anything, ever. I am not a reliable source. Okay, inventory full. Time to go. What are these damn eggs? Copper. Mm -hmm. Scientists are massive nerds. They are such... They are nerds. And it's... It's, so, it's not acceptable to bully them because they're... Uh, that do important things, I guess. Okay, up. Back to my living quarters. With my things. <gasps> my crops have grown. Oh, I left my door open. I should not have done that. Okay. Merge. Take up my hammer. I'm also gonna make some more. Um, another another chest for more storage. I'll put all of my minerals and metals in there. That way they don't get lost. Um, got some copper, and I've got some tin. Let me mush it all down. Okay, bronze. Make me some bronze. Okay, now... Hmm. 
do I? Constantan. Whoops. Constantan. Which is Constantan blend. Cons. Nickel and copper. Hmm. How much do I need for a steam dynamo? Medium at medium attic. Steam dynamo. Copper gear. Get some silver. So I still gotta get. I still gotta delve some more. I'm gonna take some extra bronze with me, so I if I if my hammer breaks, I'll be able to make a new one. More bronze, lovely bronze. Harvest my crops. these blueberries in my hot bar so I can eat them. And I'll also just throw these eggs in there because I want to get rid of them. So I still have a way to go before I can before I can really make some of the nice recipes. But for now it's acceptable. Back to the mines I go As when I have the energy, I think what I'll do is make the passage this way nicer. I can do that right now, actually. There's no reason I can't. I should have a crafting bench down here. What I also need is... Oh, I'm going to grab more of my bronze. I'm going to have to replace these with stairs at some point. I could do that right now, actually. I don't need to wait. Because I have more bronze, I can make a excavator. Which will dig big. Oh, I forgot to make stairs. Give me the... Give me the rocks. I make it into blocks. And now I have stairs. Diggy diggy. Dang it. Okay, give me. No. Yes. La 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 la. Ah, la 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 la. So I can do like so. Oops. Get back in here. Light it up some more. Yes, stairs. I love how oh, I love being able to go up and down without having to press the space bar every time I move a block. Ow. Steps go up. Yes. Okay. 
Yes. Read that. I'm moving smoothly. Yeah. That's what I like. Anyway, it's not I have an excavate. X. S. X. <laughs> what the fucker. Now that I have this excavator, I can clear out this gravel first off. Because this gravel is gonna be is gonna cause problems. Mm, I'm gonna leave that gravel because I don't I don't need that area. And I'm going to do this. That's it. I'm making progress. I'm going underground. I'm making making an area that I can go that isn't me like going through a bunch of weird loops. Let me dig up this copper. use that for anything. Manganese? I can't use manganese for anything. My, but I may as well dig it up since it's there. I will be able to make gunpowder, by the way. I can manufacture it. <laughs> Manufacturing gunpowder... Uh, traditional black powder. Um, you require three things. Ooh, here we go. Some clay. Dig up this clay, because I need. I'm gonna need clay for for a few things. Ooh. Full inventory. that. Look at that. It's so smooth. It's satisfying. It's just, I just go. I don't have to think about it. I just go. Ow. I smacked my computer. My, my, I smacked my desk. on the wall. Now I can pick you up and make sure that you don't this despawn. I just go. Yeah. I'm way too hyped about that. Oh 
everything in there. May as well, may as well smelt the iron that's here. More bronze. The copper. Put the manganese in there. That in there. That in there. That and that. Harvest my crops. More flex. Onion. Wait. A step in the right direction. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't believe you'd say that. Step in the right direction. <sighs> gosh. If you crouch while holding one of the one of the big tools, you can then dig a single block. That's what I like to do. I like steps. I like going up and down. Um, I didn't need to come back. What am I doing? I had my bronze on me for a, for a reason. Reason. More stick. And more hammer. You know what they say. Every problem looks like a nail if you have a hammer. Oh, that's one too many. I need some coal. That's one of the things that I like about um, having. One of the things that I like about having the hammer is that it digs. That often, I will be digging and I'll be mining, and I'll end up uh, find stumbling into even more minerals. And it's like, whoa, mineral central. Mineral City, rather. Here we are. Satisfaction. I'm satisfied because I can dig and I can, it just works. I don't have to spend all it going, spend the time going doot, 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 doot. I just, I just hit, I just hit one. Anyways, my inventory is full again. I'll block that up.
ba do ba do 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 more storage for the things I can store that are not enough room in there <laughs> my sand iron I like iron digging is not very exciting let's be real Can I make uh, can I make it exciting? Perhaps. Okay. Da -da -da -da. So how's everyone's night evenings going? I know I know for certain that a few of you are joining from very far away. And it is now very late at night. So you're, you think that the digging is super exciting? Okay. I wouldn't describe it as uh, exciting. But that's only because I find it a little monotonous. Hmm. Oh, I missed one. Well, if you're EP, you don't have to stick around. I'll I'll save the I'll save the VOD. So if you really, really want to watch this, this riveting, uh, the riveting gameplay of me digging in underground, then you are free to watch. You'll be free to watch the VOD of that at your own pace, on your own time. More bauxite. I'd appreciate it if they didn't, you know, shoot off their guns every few minutes. Ooh, there's the, there's the mycelium again. One of those little guys. I don't like those little guys. You're gonna sleep with my stream in the background? What if I scream or something? I'm not sure that'd be very restful. I... Besides, I'm only gonna go for about an hour longer. This is really just arbitrary time to spend with... Hold on. Can I reach him from here? I will not scream intentionally. That is all I can promise. I might freak out when I'm if I'm attacked by a monster unexpectedly. Alright, come here. Come on. Climb up. Come get me. I'm here. Monsters. Come on. I think they're having trouble pathfinding. Ow, fuck. Go fall and die. Why are there so many of them down there? That'll stop him for for the moment. Yeah, I'll be finishing roughly an hour or so. I don't want to stream all night. And also, I can't talk forever. I am not endlessly exciting. Oh. Boop, 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 boop. 
Another crafting bench. Uh, I'll put it down here. That, that seems like a good spot. Ooh, an enemy spider. Perish. Now the question is, why put my stream on in the background? I'm not, I'm, surely I'm not that exciting. Well, not exciting, because then if you'd be watching it actively. Am I relaxing and cozy? Is that a good thing? I mean, yes, of, of course it's a good thing, but is that something that I am? Aha! Got him. Ooh, glow shrooms. Gold ore. Oh, hello, buddy. You coming over this way to meet your doom? Alright. I'll see you never, I guess. Because you're dead. You can't see me if you're dead. That's how being dead works. You're you're dead. Oh man, this is a big cavern. This is cool. This is quite this is this is quite the area. I Ooh, what's this? Cobbed stone. And cobblestone. Mm -hmm. Ah, I see. Hmm. Spider area. I wonder what's in this chest. Gunpowder and sand? Why? Why is that in here? Either way, my inventory is full, so I better go back. If I know it's good for me, I'm not gonna just continue wandering the caves while I have nothing. While I have know where to put my things. Because then it becomes a problem of inventory management, and that's not something that I'm necessarily good at. Like, I can do it, but it's not a fun activity. It's also not something that would be very easy listening. Well, it kinda is easy listening. Nice to have on the background, but I don't think it'd be very exciting for me to talk about personally. <sighs> Put the things where they belong. Silver. I need to find silver. Where can I find silver? I found gold already, so that should be that's part that's part of the solution. More torches. <sighs> Things are screaming outside my house again. I wish they'd stop. Yeah, fixing this area, th this fixing this passageway was a good was a good idea. I 
की देगी See, the part where it gets real is the part where I end up having, where I have all, the, where I have the first stage of minerals that I need. Because I need, I need to get nickel. I need to get silver. Once I have nickel and silver, I can start on the actual technology. Trouble is that I have to figure out where it is. There's lead here. There's tungsten here. I'm going to dig up this gold because I will forget otherwise. Deeper. I have to go deeper. Oh. He had a gun, but he's now dead. Uranium. Uranium. Lead. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Redstone. I need. I need a redstone. Oh dear. Danger approaches. Creeper. <gasps> Cooper returns. Hi, Cooper. Okay. Ta! Bone crusher. <gasps> Silver. That's what I was looking for. Nickel. I also need nickel. That's the redstone. That's redstone. I love you too, Cooper. And yes, I was a big yawn. So I'm, I am getting a little eepy. Because this morning, before I went to work, you know what I did? I drank some caffeine. Oh boy. Which may not have been an ideal uh, development for me. Because I tend to have caffeine crashes. Nickel ore! I was waiting for you. Oh, terrifying screams. Lovely. There you are. Yeah, burn in the lava, you moron. Oh. This guy. Cha. Got him. I hope that if you fall asleep to my stream, you do not have bad dreams or weird dreams. It's not something that I would li I would not like to be the source of bad things for you. I don't need this viscera. Get out of here. I don't need this cloth. I don't need this root. And this, I can just open it. Is there anything I can condense or get rid of? Oh! Oh my. There's emeralds here. Hmm. That's that's a good find. Titanium. I can't do anything with, that, with titanium. Nickel, silver, and nickel. <gasps> silver. More silver. Oop. What is that? that's more gold? 
This area is very dangerous, so I would be wise if I did not stay. That's my inventory filled up. How do I leave? I forgot where I came in. This is not great. This is not... This isn't uh, ideal. This way, I think. Yeah, perish. Perish as your predecessor did. Danger. Got him. Oop. I don't know why I keep pressing onward. Um, silver chunks. This is silver. I got everything. Back I go. That's silver. Okay, I'm just blind. I I just for, I just forgot that was silver. I forgot that was what silver looked like. It's not always easy to tell what something is if you're not familiar with how it looks. What am I saying? That's how, that's how things work. <laughs> okay. Minerals. I'm going to... Firstly... The nickel. No, I shouldn't smelt the nickel. I'll smelt the silver, though. Give me the coal. Silver. Silver. Because I... to make a constant tan I need oops a constant tan blend which is equal parts copper and nickel I am not eating the minerals I need, I'm not going to eat minerals it's not good for my teeth Um, there's my hammer. Smashy, smashy. I got a silver, and that means I can make a coil, a transmission coil. Uh, my pulverizer requires a piston, copper gear, and I got some gold. gold mix the copper and nickel into constant tan put it in there I'll put away this I'll put away fuck this and this and that and that as well iron goes in the chest with the minerals uh granite I don't need granite 
Okay, give me my gold bar. Give me that. I do need my iron right now, though. I go like so. Can I smash this with my hammer to make... No, I can't. Which means I need to find some sand. Where's the sun? Not visible, so we don't have very long. Oh, that's, that's convenient. There's sand over there. There we go. Very little ecological devastation. Hello, cow. Oh, you're injured. That doesn't seem like a good thing for you. All of you should avoid being injured if possible. Being injured is not fun. Okay. Now that I have some sand, I can make that into glass. And the glass I can then use. Need some copper gears. I need some tin. So I can make a gear out of tin. I'd also need for the pulverizer. Flint, I've got some flint. Two glass, three glass, one more. Four glass. This is what I needed. Because now... I forgot about the tin. One more tin. Come on, tin. You can do it. There. Make some tin into a gear. And make a box around the gear. Place the box in the middle. The receptor coil goes there. I take my flints and I take my gears. And here is my pulverizer. Essentially, the function that this serves is you put ore in and it grinds it up and then it spits out more um, grit which makes it a very useful thing but I also need to make a steam dynamo which is not that difficult how many copper one copper gear that wait iron and here is the steam dynamo. I still need a little bit more for this to be operational. Ooh, and I need to make my wires. Okay. I need some iron. Smelt up some more iron. I need, I have copper. I need to make the clay into terracotta. I gotta smelt up the terracotta. Um, actually. 
actually I should put all the iron through. Oh, I better get up my hammer. I have my hammer. I can smash these to make plates. If I take my shears, I can use the shears to make these plates to copper wires. Make one more. Then I can put them on a stick to make a spool of low voltage wire. Now I take the terracotta, I take my iron, I put two copper, like so. I should go three, I, oh, I put three copper. Then I put terracotta here, and it makes my low voltage connectors. So, connector, connector. I also need to make some pipes. Iron plates, or uh, one more plate. Oof. Okay. Put those there. Put that there. There's my pump. So if I take this, I should take up like ore too. But what I'm doing, I should have close, so I'll do this. I'm going to grab my bucket. I fill this reservoir with water. And then I do the same to the second level. I place the pump like so. to make that an output, and I start, oh, I need one more pipe, pipe segment. I guess that's it for that one. Make another hammer, because I broke my other one. Okay. Pipe sections. Connect that pipe there. I uh, should now have more terracotta. Oh, I need more copper. Smelt this pulverized copper, please. So, I have to change that to be input. Make that an input as well. I need to make some hoppers.
which I can now put this as a placeholder block. Okay, now that I have the copper, I can make a connector, a relay. Because I need not only to hook a wire to that machine, I have to hook a wire to the fluid pump. Because this needs water to function. I can fill it up manually. I need something to burn inside of it. It's, it's a steam dynamo and it, it requires a fuel, some sort of fuel. Burns the fuel, produces energy, energy comes out, Oh, I need a, I still need a lever for that. Stick, cobble, lever. So that has to be powered by redstone for it to pump. So it's gonna that's gonna keep this topped up. And every time it burns one of these and makes twenty four thousand twenty four thousand power. So each one of those should power this for one one give it one full power. Oh boy. There are a lot of creatures outside my helm. Anyways, that there. Get out my minerals. And now it will grind up my ore into dust. And that dust Every time it makes it, it makes two. For every ore, I get two dust, which means I have effectively doubled my in my ingot capacity, my ingot production rather. I'm gonna have to do something about these guys outside my house. Yeah, buddy. Torch. Why is that torch on the ground? Hmm. Hmm. I should light up the area more thoroughly. Oh, there's guys just hanging out on the side of the mountain, huh? Well, I can't let them live there for free. Oh, put one of 
is in there. There. Now I should be able to put a chest on top of that. And that is where I can put all of my things. Occasionally, just emptying my inventory of everything in it is just, it helps me clear, not only clear out the inventory, but clear my head. Sometimes I just get lost in the sauce, you know? That's what they call it in the business. Lost in the sauce. So this will be powered. So if I want to make this. If I want to make this a little more efficient, I can make I can put coal blocks into it. It's not that I'm a landlord, it's that these guys are dangerous and I do not want them around. Their presence is causing me harm. Therefore, I must build. Okay. Vacuous system. Disgusting. Let me dislodge these creatures. Oh boy, there's a lot of them. No, don't explode into bits. I don't like it when you do that. You are littering. You are polluting the environment. Stop it. I wasn't paying attention. Anyways, thanks to my ghostly presence, I can... Oh. Let it load for a moment. Thanks to being a ghost now, I can go over there and recollect my items. Without any fear of losing them. Now, tree should go. So I need to work on making this area more secure. Up, up, 
Papa. And part of making the area more secure is providing me with space so that I can... Warwick. Say hi to everybody, Warwick. Little kitty. He's showing up. But he's showing up because he's hungry. He wants me to feed him. He's a spoiled kitty. Far too spoiled for his own good. <sighs> Your claw's stuck, buddy. You can't just do that every time you're hungry. You're gonna get stuck and you're gonna go tug and tug and tug and then... Oh, butthead. He wants me to feed him, but I don't... I'm not gonna feed him because we feed him too much. He is overweight. We have... we had to put him on a diet because he's, he was overweight. really being stubborn, so... Hopefully, this will be enough to keep this part of the mountain safe. What do you mean you'd be a stinky kitty? Oh, danger approaches. Better get inside. <laughs> Buddy. <laughs> oh dear, there's danger. Inside my the, the the area I made. No, not in here. Concerning. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know what? Oh, that's the thumbcraft thing. I think it's it's getting late for everyone. I am of the opinion that I should call it. Excuse me. I'm gonna kill you. What an assist. Oh. Does that have stuff in it? Maple, I regret to inform you that they are not friends. They are enemies. Anyways, as I was going to say, I think I should finish for the night. Warwick is hungry. I need to have a snack. Yeah, I gotta eat something else. I have I ate before I left work, but also I gotta eat more. Uh, I hope everyone had a good time. I'm not going to bed, Cooper. I'm just finishing my stream. He'll see me in a little bit. But yeah, thanks everyone for coming. I hope you have. I hope. I hope you have. I hope. I hope. I hope you have a good night. <laughs> um.
there. 